हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू गेट वाला एवरी डे एवरी स्टूडेंट मैक्सिमम स्टूडेंट आर आस्किंग अबाउट गेट 2025 सम आइडियल काइंड ऑफ स्ट्रेटजी ना एक्चुअली आई एम सेइंग टू यू दैट देयर इज नथिंग लाइक आइडियल ना इफ समथिंग इज सुटेड टू यू दैट इज द बेस्ट पॉसिबल ऑप्शन फॉर यू फॉर द प्रिपरेशन द गेट 2025 नाउ यू कैन सी दैट हाउ मेनी मंथ्स आर रिमेनिंग हाउ मेनी डेज आर रिमेनिंग If you see right now, it is month has been started. Now, now you have only July, August, September, October, November, and December. Don't count the January month because January month is is dedicated especially for something very special that I will tell you in some other video. But right now you have to plan for the six six to seven months. Approximately seven months are remaining. Right now you have, and still if you are searching. for the gate 2025 strategy then i am telling you you are absolute right now just start your preparation there is nothing like strategy for the preparation the important point is what the exit the plan if you are thinking something if you have made your plan made your mind that you are going to prepare for the gate like examination then you Have to start now because if you didn't start, if you did not start it, then it's okay. If you have just thought about the gate 2025, but now if you have decided, then it is now and never situation. It's not like that that you can wait for one more month and you will decide then whether I have to go for the gate 2025 or not. Now, it's it is the situation. This is the. last and final time this is the last announcement this is the last boarding for you that you are going to ride on the preparation journey of the gate 2025 so the situation is do it now or you will never think about the gate like examination now if you want to plan for the gate 2025 right now then you need to track three points na? only three points you have to take care na regarding these three points i will tell everything but please promise to yourself that i will stick myself sir on these three points only you need not to do any other thing just follow the three points now what are the three core points of the gate 2025 who have started right now or anyone started one month or two months four these are the three points these are the core points now first of all make your mind to ready for yourself that must have to target the subjects that out of let's say you have a 12 subject in your branch na whatever the branch will be na i don't care about the branch na if the number of subject is something na let's say it's a 10 or 12 subjects na need to need to strategize that how many subjects are highly weighted subjects na so please make a note point make a in a write down somewhere in your copy or notebook or in your wall whatever where you want to write down write down the first of all the top priority subjects na minimum subject yeah, that you have to target for gate 2025 7 to 8 subjects have to target for the 7 to 8 rather than thinking about that how i can complete the sub total number of the subject that is the 10 or 12 you have to focus on the seven and eight subject that are the highly highly scoring subjects from your technical or from the maths and aptitude branches na so maths and aptitude will be included and five or six subjects must be at least from the technical segment na this is the first thing you have to do it na now you need not to think about the completion of the syllabus na if completion of the syllabus is reflection of the selection in the gate examination then if maximum students are completing the syllabus but still they are not get, getting even 10 to 12 or 20 marks in the gate examination so just think about this one na make a targeted study that is important for all of you na now coming to the next one na resources must be very very limited na what are the resources must be only your class lectures that's it na only your class lecture need not to watch any youtube any whatever the textbook and nothing you have to read if you are doing preparation for the particular subjects na if running subject is there let's say network theory in electrical and ec then you have to follow the pankaj shukla sir lecture only that's it nothing else na the second you have to take care what that pyq na 
PYQ is the most prioritized rather than the practice sheet. Na? So you must have the PW gate wala book also. You have to practice the PYQ also na, along with the lecture. This is the second thing. Third point is the practice sheet. Na? If you found the time, then you have to go with the practice sheet also along with the lecture. And then after it is the test series that is very, very required. Gate 2020 test series is also there in the PW app. You can opt for it. Because that is very important to evaluate yourself in all these subjects that is the 7 to 8 subjects. Na? So, this second one is the very crucial. Na? The students always try to complete one subject from number of resources. Na? They are doing the classes, they are referring the textbook, they are referring some other lectures also, they are following the NPDL also. Don't do that. Na? It's competitive examination, not your PhD examination. Na? It's your competitive examination. Think about like that. Na? What exactly the competitive examination required for this preparation? You have to take care of all those things only. Na? So, resources, you have to follow these four resources only. Nothing extra. Na? That means if you are enrolled in the English batches, the only thing you have to follow what is provided in the batch only. Na? Nothing else you have to do. It, na? Now, coming to the third and most important that everybody is just ignoring. Na? And they will recall it at what time when the examination will be nearer to the one month or two months before. Na? Even somebody is trying to do this particular segment, that is the revision, that is the most critical part of your preparation just before 15 days. It's a wrong approach to have to do things. Na? First thing, daily revision. Daily revision is a compulsory and mandatory thing. Whatever the current subject running in the batch you are studying, every day give yourself at any cost. Na? At any cost, you have to give 15 minutes for that particular subject, whatever the topic in that day has been completed, you have to revise to the notes what you have prepared for that particular lecture. Every day means every day. Na? Now, coming to the next one, what is the weekly revision? Every week, give at least 5 to 6 hours. You can opt for Saturday, you can opt for the Sunday also. It's your choice. Na? But at least 4 to 5 hours, you have to give the old one subjects na, that you have already completed in your batches. You have to take care of this thing. Very, very important. In this way, approach it. Then revision. In this way, if you approach it, then this completion of the lecture, PYQ, practice test series, and your number of the subject. Everything will be completed on the right time. And definitely, you are going to crack the examination in a beautiful manner. Na. But if you don't want to do want to engage yourself in number of things you can do it what will be the result the result will be you are going to get nothing in the examination i'm telling you this is my experience of the 10 to 15 years that you have to be very strict about your plans and also na? so this particular session is all about the it's now or never situation don't wait for more beta because you have spoiled approximately three to four to five months already for this year particularly 24 you have only very limited time at least now start it and start execution your plan that is very important so thank you so much guys we will meet in the next video with some other topics that is relevant to this particular examination and relevant to the preparation of the student definitely we will talk about that also and please make your comment and tell me about what exactly you are doing if you have any issue and comment in the chat box definitely i will take a time and reply your all queries. Thank you so much.